All right, let's hear what this beautiful thumb has to say. Bro, he put hashtag Uvalde. The force is strong 35. 352,000 followers? What the fuck? I'm sobbing. My nephew's daughter was one of the children killed in Uvalde. Those precious babies. What? Why are you sobbing in this, like, fucking cops? Uh, does she not realize it was the cops negligence that, like, led to them dying? What the fuck? Shutterstock.com. I will cover the children with my own body. Oh, this is so fucked up, dude. To protect their life. I will be their rock. I'm here to protect and will as long as I'm alive. Dude, that's awesome. First comment reads, I showed my daughter this video. Her exact words were, Mama, that's one of the good ones. Can he come to my school? Wait, this is cop racism? <laughs> Bro, daughter's woke as fuck. Daughter's woke as fuck, dude. She said one of them good ones. Mama, this is an articulate cop. <laughs> Mama, this is such a clean-cut, articulate cop. Can he come to the school? <laughs> oh, she made up a fake story, but <laughs> it came out so funny. Oh, this is amazing. Thank you for your service, us. This cop is so brave for saying something that he will never have to back up. Oh, man. <laughs> As a mother, there are no words one can say to thank you and others who put their lives on the line every day. Thank you for your service and sacrifice. Oh, dude, so many cop wives, dude. Thank you for all that you do. You are appreciated. That's sad. What's sad is we live in a world where others have to risk their lives to save children. You're an amazing man. Thank you for all you do. But he didn't save the kids. What, he hasn't done anything. This is the perfect fucking example of how, like, cops operate, okay? Like, this guy is a canine unit, okay? His express, his exclusive purpose at his job is to literally touch a fucking car so that the, the, the police dog jumps up at the car so they can, like, illegally detain and violate the Fourth Amendment. His entire job is to legally violate the fourth amendment that's it that's all this motherfucker does that's the guy that they use to hold you up when they stop you and they say oh i smell marijuana in your car you say fuck no officer i don't have fucking marijuana in my car and then the fucking cop says well you want to fucking not show me your trunk well guess what dude i'm sending the fucking canine unit it's gonna take three and a half hours it's gonna jam you up i'm gonna fuck you up dude i'm gonna fuck your day up maybe you had to go to a job Maybe you're not going to go to your job no more because you are preventing me from looking through your shit. So now you got to wait. Okay? And then this fucking dickhead comes in with his dog, okay? And, you know, taps at a fucking roof of the car a little bit so the dog's like, oh, there's drugs in here so that they can have now a, a justifiable reason to enter your fucking car and fuck up your car. That's it. That's all this motherfucker does, okay? And ironically, the dog is doing all the work, too. <laughs> it's not. He's just exploiting this fucking dog. Let's see how many highs I can get back. <laughs> Yo, he's got the new Gingrich wife filter on, dude. What the fuck? Oh, no. You guys know what I'm talking about, by the way? Oh, 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 my Lord. Oh, this is so good. This is so good. You can't comment. I think the comments are not off. Uh, the comments are not on. He's got 495 likes. No comments. Uh-oh. Comments were not off. Oh, it says there's 276 comments, but you can't see them. 
How many highs can I get? That's what he said. Let's see how many highs I can get back. I did. I didn't. I shouldn't have tapped the glass. I'm deleting this. I. I don't. I don't want to. No, never tap the glass. Never tap the glass. Tell you, it's been a rough 11 years in this business. And it, some advice that I'd give new people. We don't want the bad ones just as much as y'all don't. Coming into this. Be honest, one. Once you're dishonest, your integrity's gone for the rest of your career. Again, he's in. Oh, he pinned it. Get he pinned out. the blushing. He pinned the blush on his badge, dude. Treat the people with respect that you arrest. Help your citizens. Bro, this dude literally can't even fucking talk, dude. He is such a. Dude, what the fuck? These are the homies that have, like, carte blanche, like, fucking license to kill, dude. Think about that. Like, there, we need to do something. We need to do something about this. We, these are, this is the dumbest motherfucker on the planet, dude. He can't even fucking finish a sentence. How, and he, he could just kill you. And it, some advice that I'd give new people coming into this. Be honest, one. Once you're dishonest, your integrity's gone for the rest of your career. Get out. Yeah, totally. Cops famously never lie. Especially not on the stand or not while they're fucking uh, trying to establish probable cause when there is none or not when they're, uh, you know, um, not when they're writing a fucking arrest report. His target audience is only white women. Yeah, straight up. Get out. Treat the people with respect that you arrest. Help your citizens when they need them. Don't screw your partner over. I've been screwed over by more law enforcement officers than I have anybody else. Oh, one of them fucked his wife. Which is why... One of them 100% fucked his wife. That's precisely why his target audience is literally cop wives that want to suck and fuck him. And cheat on their cop husbands, okay? Like, cop wives think that as long as you're fucking and sucking another cop, it actually is not like cheating because they're all brothers, you know what I mean? The band of brothers. That's how it works. Cops really make the best TikToks. I love you for it. <laughs> I'm fucking dying. What is this body type, dude? Dude, look at this fucking thumb, dude. He literally transformed. Dude, it's so fun. It's so awesome. Oh, God, I love this, dude. I fucking love this shit so much. I got r slash protect and serve for the best cops crying like pussies over people not liking them. Bro, he's got his fucking light in the back, too. Like, he's like... Wee-woo, wee-woo. These are literally my favorite thirst traps. Love my men and women in the blue, says Candace Goslin. Who requested this, Lamau? <laughs> What? Can you do that again, please? I was washing my water. Got to make sure that H2O is watered down good. Oh, this is so sick. They're like flirting. So, uh, was I the only one who saw the profile pic and got excited? Oh my God. Thinking it would transition to the canine because I'm sad now. Canine Nico usually gets all the spotlight. Dude, dude. Dude, Kimberly is a furry. That's a white woman moment. Sorry. Is that a cup or are you just excited to see us? Excuse me, officer. I've done some bad things, says Kenzie Lewis. This woman hit How the nail on the head. Right now. Seriously, he is trying all he can to show you that he loves you and that he's there for you. Trying to be your shoulder to cry on through all your overthinking and your crazy moments. And you're pushing him away. 
For what? Anxiety is a major killer in relationships? What the fuck? Yo, cop and divorce dad. You know another cop fucked his wife. Oh my God, I'm losing it. Oh, the story. The story is literally unfolding 100%. Another cop fucked his wife 100%, dude. Oh my God. Oh, oh, this is so good. That's why he became a canine officer. Less chance of his partner fucking his wife. <laughs> For what? Okay, I'm I'm beginning to actually, you know what? I'm going back on the fucking Tim uh, Kennedy uh, t takes that I had earlier. Yes, we have pussified our cops. I think there's a Chinese conspiracy on Tic Tac. They're, they're making our cops pussies. They're making our cops gay, brother. <laughs> they're... <laughs> They're spending too much time on Tic Tac. God, what a fucking little baby. He's so rare to come by. Guys who actually give a fuck are so rare to come by, and you're just pushing this one away. Like, he's nothing. Why? Everybody I know... Who hurt you, brother? Who fucking hurt you, brother? We always ask, where are the good guys at? Hun, he's right in front of you. Yeah, I'm right here. Don't fuck it up. I'm right here. What? Do what we like to do. They get to do it. We don't, we, don't, we don't get to do it. They say we can't speed. They the fastest motherfuckers on the highway. They say we can't drive and text, but they got a goddamn laptop in the front seat. You gonna tell me I can't text you using a mouse, motherfucker? What is wrong with me? <laughs> Wait, what? He's just like openly admitting that they fucking... This is why they have so many vehicular accidents, dude. That cop probably earning overtime while making these Tic Tacs. You know it, dude. Made a Uvalde conspiracy short on YouTube. Is this a poop sock? I'm going to address the elephant in the room here. Oh, but my God. Oh, this is the other. Fun. Chat. Chatter. This is a separate thumb. This is not the same. We will. We will. Alert. Alert. This is a separate thumb chatter. I know they always look the same, but this is not the same. This is not the same thumb. This is a different thumb. We already saw this is like Sergeant Dingle or something. Okay. Daniel Shrigley. Funny. Not funny because it's not funny, but strange. When I say funny, I mean strange. Suspect. That the proximity of these three mass shootings so close to an election. Don't you find that really questionable? Yeah. So what? Brother, there's a mass shooting every day. What? There's like more than one mass shooting every day. What the fuck do you mean so close to an election? It is... They have mass shootings during elections. This is America. What? TikTok cringe cop on duty. Hey guys, I got a challenge for you. Have you ever been pulled over by the cops and you thought to yourself, hey, I sure hope I don't get a ticket. Or two, I wish there was some way I can get out this ticket. But well, here's how you can. For every 50 followers gained from this video, I'll be writing one warning citation, okay? So what that means is, what? when I pull someone over, they're guaranteed a warning citation from me. All you have to do is follow me. So you go from a traffic ticket to a warning ticket. There is no shot that he didn't actually go. He didn't, he didn't get fucking punished for this. What? I mean, awesome, but also no shot. No fucking shot, dude. It's police Mr. Beast. <laughs> yeah. Like I say guarantee, and that goes for speeding or any other. People saying this is illegal. They ain't heard of PBA cards. Yeah, except like. Um, except making a fucking TikTok about this is entirely different than like, you know, obviously get out of jail free cards in the form of PBA card, uh, cards or, uh, or, or having like, um, what is it? Like there's like a, a license plate, the a commemorative license plate for donations of the police force, which is another way to fucking violate the rules and the law routinely, consistently. 
Um, PBA cards aren't guaranteed either, especially since they have to be kept up with yearly. Yeah. The violation. Let's see how many people can get a get out a ticket free pass. Wait, um, they have the hundred club in my city. It's a sticker though. Uh, a PBA card is when you are a police benevolence association card. It's given to people who are like, uh, family members of police officers or like fucking people who are thumb sucking super hard. Yes. I stole that comment from a chat, by the way, uh, from a chatter thumb suckers. I love that. That's a great fucking take. It's the 1199 foundation. 1199 foundation cop literally almost just killed my girlfriend like an hour ago <laughs> for every 50 followers i will not shoot an unarmed black man let's get those follows up hashtag cop talked do you want to build a snowman all i want to do is play but they always hide i'm not sure why the funniest part is like he, he's he's actually arriving on scene for a domestic violence call like, he's on scene for a domestic disturbance. And he's like, oh, shit, hold on. Let me get my fucking camera out. <laughs> oh, dude. Always asking me what I got on. New vest like, goofing. Hey, Brandon, what you got on? Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it, sweetheart. Don't oh, God, the baby voice. Okay. Dude, 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 dude. <laughs> New vest goofing is so funny. Because it's a Nino, uh, Nino, a Reno 911 reference, right? Which is an entire show making fun of fucking cops and how stupid they are. So, like, this dude literally watched the show and was like, I don't get it. Lou represents the officer and the courage they find deep inside when faced with unbelievable odds. The black background. Apologize to the P word, man. What's the P word? Did you just say the P word? What, like pussy or pig? Police? Piggy? Oh, 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 piggy, yeah. That's our word! Um <laughs> was designed as a constant reminder of our fallen brothers and sisters. I'm a cop. That was awesome. The blue laser. The thin blue laser reminding us of all of our fallen, fallen brothers and sisters. Why have they fallen? Uh, COVID-19, heart disease, uh, chasing after someone for once in their lives and then their body fucking falling apart immediately, driving incredibly irresponsibly on the fucking road and then like, you know, sucking on uh, a, a uh, like a traffic light or something, friendly fire. And of course, how could I forget fentanyl exposure, dude? That's right. Getting shot by other cops. If you've ever wondered what sheriff deputies do when they're not responding to a call, prepare to be enlightened. Drop the base. This is kind of like a like a form of of emotional terrorism. Hassan, please make it stop. Stop showing us this. No shot, dude. We're hashtag humanizing the badge, baby. What? Blue line, Kyle. For you, page with a bulletproof we vest, weapon, and lots of other equipment on my belt. Make it, make it, do it. Makes us. Stronger. Wait, why is this impressive? I don't understand. This is like the most basic thing, dude. What? To be fair, though, to be fair, for a cop, that is kind of impressive. Like, I, I half of those motherfuckers can't physically do a push-up because their belly is obstructing. You know what I mean? He is the most in-shape cop. Fuck. Oh my god. Oh my god. This is this is the lot this is literally that's it. Th th 
You've only seen Tactical Oakley's thus far. This is the greatest Tactical Oakley that you could ever wear. Paintball glasses. Oh my god, he's the final boss. Badge bunnies be like. Oh my god, he said hashtag badge bunnies. Bro, this dude being that horny should be illegal, okay? Oh god, oh Jesus, Lord mercy. He said badge bunnies. I got a plan. Might get us both killed, but if it works, it'll be a totally boss story. Cool? No. No, it's not cool. Cool. No, I said it's not cool. I said, I said it's not cool. Time. What the fuck? Erase memories and start over? Oh my god! What the fuck, dude? Yeah! Bro, these dudes are such fucking lame asses. I'm dying, dude. No. 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 No way, dude. Oh my god. What the fuck? He's erasing his memories of being a fucking hog, dude. He's erasing his Thumbelina ass memories, brother. Oh, yeah, that's right. I'm going a day without. I can't. I need to stop thinking about them. This dude got fired from being a hog. Yeah, what happened? Okay. No shot. This guy this early left the fucking uh, police force. He probably left because he probably. He had to have left the fucking police force because he was like, there was too much scrutiny. Like, he, he got too many fucking suspensions or some shit. No shot. <laughs> Memories restored. Dude, what happened to this guy? I need to know what the fuck happened. Yeah, he didn't quit because of the vaccine mandate. He's too young. Dude, come on. You guys literally you guys literally got suckered into believing that shit. None of the fucking cops that actually retired literally fucking retired because of the vaccine mandate. They retired because they were already like about to fucking retire.